teenagers. I believe teenagers are God's revenge on mankind. I really do. I think, I think one day the good Lord was looking down over his creation and said, let's see how they like it to create someone of their own image who denies their existence. <laughs> Because I have read the Bible more than once, cover to cover, and it, it never mentions how old the devil was when he rejected God's authority. If I'm guessing an age, I'm saying 16. Devil got his driver's license, drove to Georgia, that's all I know. One heck of a fiddle player, buddy. You can't argue with a 16-year-old. You can't. They have a three-word vocabulary. That's it. <laughs> is a word. <laughs> you gonna pass your history test? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> is another word. <laughs> well, you can't spend the night at your friend's house. You flunked the history test. And then that word, whatever, whatever, drove me insane. It affected my nerves. Because when it would come out of their mouths, I'd immediately boink them right in the eyes. <laughs> whatever, <laughs> stop that. <laughs> and get your little angels ready for therapy. They're going. This is America. Your kid's gonna lay on a couch at some point in his life and blame you for everything. You might as well give him reasons going in. <laughs> Don't stress about it, they're gonna do it. I told my kids when they learn to write, when you perceive an injustice in our home, do us all a favor, write it down and date it and I'll initial it for you. How <laughs> come? Well, when you're middle-aged, my memory's not so good, we could breeze through the therapeutic process together. <laughs> I'll just hand that book to the therapist. All that stuff with my initials next to it, I did and I'll be at the golf course. <laughs> I don't get it, where we're at as a nation, we got 40 year old men calling up their 65 year old fathers and yelling at them at two in the morning and blaming them for all the grief in their life. It may be true, may have had a rotten father, but at this point in his life, what do you expect him to do for you? I got my answer ready, I'm waiting for one of my sons to call me up at two in the morning. You ruined my life. All I'm gonna say is, whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Do over, you know? Well, we didn't mean to ruin your life. Hey, why don't you move back home? Me and Mom will re-raise you. <laughs> yeah, we're a lot calmer since our strokes, don't you know? <laughs> we can't remember when bedtime is. We we can't remember anything. You can you can move home and help us find our shoes in the morning. That'll be fun. <laughs> we can't find anything around here. Remote controls, car keys. It's like a scavenger hunt every day. <laughs> you sure do sound like a nice young man. What was your name again? <laughs> Did you know that Dry Bar Comedy has their own app? You can download it right now to watch, save, and share clips, and you can watch my entire comedy special right on your phone. How cool is that?